Have you ever pondered why a size 6 is often idealized in our society? Why this particular measurement holds such sway, such power, over our collective consciousness? It's a question that Moroccan feminist writer and sociologist Fatima Mernisi delves into in her captivating book, Size 6, The Western Women's Harem. In this thought-provoking exploration, Mernisi scrutinizes the impact of Western beauty standards on women across the globe, arguing that the pressure to conform to these standards builds a metaphorical harem. This harem isn't a physical space, but a societal construct where women are confined and controlled by the expectations of beauty. Mernisi boldly contrasts the Western ideal of a size 6 with the diverse beauty standards found in various cultures. She critiques the narrow definition of beauty sustained by Western media, shedding light on how it can foster body dissatisfaction and low self-esteem among women. Through personal anecdotes, historical analysis and cultural observations, Mernisi challenges us to question, to resist these oppressive standards of beauty. She encourages us to celebrate the diverse forms of beauty and empower women to define beauty on their own terms, not through a lens dictated by society. In her profound book, Size 6, The Western Women's Harem, Mernissi offers a powerful critique of beauty standards and their impact on women's lives. She urges us to reconsider and redefine our notions of beauty and identity. It's a call to action, a call to break free from the metaphorical harem of societal expectations, a call to embrace diversity and individuality in beauty. In this video, we've unraveled the main themes and arguments Mernisi presents in her book. We've discussed the metaphorical harem created by societal beauty standards, the critique of the size 6 ideal, and the impact of these standards on women's self-esteem and body image. We've also delved into Mernissi's call to challenge, resist, and redefine these oppressive standards, to empower women to define beauty on their own terms. Remember, beauty isn't confined to a size, a number, or a societal ideal. It's diverse, it's individual, and it's time we celebrate it as such.